Uh, Abha Singh, would you agree Poonam, with Poonam Mutreja's point that education is the best contraceptive or two-child policy is just not going to work in India? No, I don't think so. I mean, Supreme Court is very right when it says that whatever uh, uh, rules have been imposed by Rajasthan government pertaining to two-child policy, it has upheld that. In fact, I would like to draw your attention that every third child in India is stunted and every second woman in India is Anemic. We are 101 rank on the global hunger index. So you 51% of our children are exposed to hunger and malnutrition. At a time when we cannot cater to the present children, why are we producing more? That is my question. I think two-child policy is required because wherever you have seen that uh, the states like the South State, the uh, South States of South India, where there's high education, there is mm, uh, literacy population is down. So that clearly shows that the states like Uttar Pradesh are, are lagging behind. And that is the reason we need a two-child norm. We are talking of reproductive freedom. But do women in India have reproductive freedom? My learned friend herself said that there's something called sun meta preference. So where women are pressurized to have more children because the need for the sun is so high. So at that time, this law would come to their benefit. And also these incentives, because if you are cutting down the subsidies, you don't let them uh, contest panchayat elections. I think we require certain strict laws because voluntary things don't happen that fast. So I feel it is necessary, the two-child norm. And okay. if we talk of equality, it is imposed on one and all. So uh, if we keep waiting for voluntary measures, it's going to be long and long. And when we are talking of five trillion economy, I think the time has come that we actually cut down on the population because okay. you are violating the rights of the children by producing eight, nine children in a family. So when you have less of uh, oxygen, the way pollution is happening, you have less of food. Why are you producing children to have them stunted and malnourished?